Hey everybody, Stephanie Ramirez here and welcome back to my channel. So today we are doing a lazy girl makeup look. So the other day my boyfriend um, asked me out to go for happy hour and drinks and gave me all of a five minute notice to get ready. Well, that's 10, but five minute notice to get ready. Um, and so I needed to just get something on my face that was like wham bam out the door and I posted and asked if you guys wanted to see a super easy quick uh, go to makeup routine for those kind of situations and you guys showed a lot of love on that so you guys voted yes um, there were a few of you that voted no but you don't have to watch this then so this is for you guys this is for the majority um, if you like want to see how I achieved this easy no foundation and no concealer look I know, I don't know who I am either. Um, then just keep watching. So whether I'm doing a full glam look or just like a wham bam out the door kind of look, I always make sure that I'm prepping my face. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go with my Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. This and the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Primer Water are two of my favorites. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just let that dry a second. And then I'm gonna moisturize my face with the Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. Um, I've been recently using um, a lot of their rose products from Fresh. And I've been really, really pleased with the results in just a week's time saw a dramatically um, amount of improvement in my skin as far as complexion and like hydration and just smoothness. Um, I've never had that quick of results by using um, a skincare line. So I'm really, really happy with them. I'm definitely going to be sticking to this for a while. And I just like to press the... Uh, moisturizer into my skin make sure it's really in getting little getting into my pores also by the way I do have the Mac lip conditioner on my lips right now I do like to just have this sit um, while I'm prepping my face and then I wipe it off at the end before I put on my lip product but that way it's just really soaking up a lot of like hydration and moisture we don't want those crusty lips and then for primer today, I'm going to be using the Porefessional Hydrate Primer. I got this in my BoxyCharm, I think two months ago, and I've been really enjoying it so far. So I just need a little dab, and I like to just warm it up in my hands a little bit. And just apply it all over. Today we're not going to be going with a full face of foundation. We're just going to apply a small amount of product to the high points of our cheeks. And this is just to kind of give a look of like, I'm awake, I'm alive, I swear, even though I'm not wearing makeup. So we're going to be going in with the Wander Nude Illusion Liquid Foundation. I got this in my BoxyCharm as well a few months back. And I've used it a few times and I've actually really liked it. And I kind of forgot about it. And when I was going through my drawers the other day, I found it and I was like, ooh like digging for gold so I'm just gonna apply this to like I said the high points of my cheeks like so this foundation has like a nice uh, like natural glow to it so that's perfect for the look that we're going for and then I'm just gonna be using this Allmark cosmetics brightening brush to blend it in give it a quick spray and we're gonna go ahead and just blend it out you see how it's already kind of brightening up that area and then I'm just gonna take the excess product that's on the brush and just dab under our eyes. Since we're not gonna be using concealer today. <laughs> I know, who is she? And again, just dabbing under the eyes. I'm just gonna dab a little bit here in this area because sometimes you tend to get red a little bit right here and have some discoloration. So I'm just gonna dab any excess product that's on my brush right in that area. So now we're gonna add a little bit of highlight. This is the Nudies All Over Face Color in the shade Hey Honey. Um, they sent this to me in a PR package uh, last week with like a bunch of goodies and I was super excited because when I swatched it, I was like, this is the perfect summer tone highlighter. Um, and it doesn't look like you're trying too hard when you put it on. So I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this to the high points of my cheeks. I'm also gonna hit like right above the brow bone. I'm gonna use a brush. I'm just gonna pat it in with my hands. This product is super easy to work with, so it's not very high maintenance. So I'm just gonna dab. For blush, we are also gonna go in with the Nude Sticks Nudies All Over Face Color, and this is in the shade Naughty and Spice. I was really excited when Nude Sticks sent me these because I've been wanting to experiment with cream, little cream blushes, but I've just always kind of like 
stayed away, but I've just been seeing it so much more on like YouTube and social media and it just has been intriguing me lately. So I was like pretty pumped when they sent me this because I was like, if I'm gonna have a cream blush moment for the first time, I want it to be with nude sticks. So I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm going to apply this to the apples of my cheeks. I look like a little china doll. And I'm just gonna go ahead and use this Olimar Cosmetics complexion brush to just blend it out. And this product blends out so nicely. Like I said, like even with the highlighter, like it's just so low maintenance. Like I could really just blend this out with my hand actually if I wanted to, but I really love these brushes from all of our. And then for bronzer today, we're just gonna add a little bit of warmth to the face. This is the Bronze Goddess from Estee Lauder. And I'm just gonna be using this Moda buffing brush to just apply it to the face. And I always like to say that you apply your bronzer wherever the sun would naturally hit your face. So obviously your cheekbones, and then we're gonna hit the hairline. And then just below the chin. For brows, we're gonna be using the Benefit Cosmetics Full Proof Brow Powder. And as always, I like to start by underlining the brow. and outlining the brow. And then I just like to fill in the sparseness. And I like to use short flicking motions, going like upwards and kind of slanted, 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 to make it seem like as hair-like as possible. And then I already have a little bit of mascara on from earlier. Um, I was running errands, so I popped some on so I didn't look like lifeless. Um, but this is the L'Oreal Lash Paradise and I'm just gonna layer a little bit of this on. I sound like a broken record, but this is absolutely my favorite mascara. It's drugstore, so you can get it at like CVS, Walgreens, you can get it at Target. Can anyone else put on mascara without opening their mouth? And then for lips, we're not gonna line lips today because this is a lazy girl makeup and lazy girls don't line their lips. So we're just gonna go in with some liquid lipstick. This is the Dose of Colors liquid lipstick in Nude Mood. You guys know I always like a little bit of a glossy finish. So this is the Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. Not that I need to be injecting my lips. And then whether I'm doing a full face or just minimalistic like this, I never ever skip the step of setting my face. So this is the Morphe Mattifying Continuous Setting List. I'm just gonna go ahead and set the makeup. All right, everyone, so this is the finished look. It's just super simplistic, it's easy, nothing complicated, just a little something to get you in and out the door, not in and out the door, out the door quickly, um, and just make you look like you have a little life to your face. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave any comments down below on what you'd like to see next, and I will see you all in my next video.